Okay, so we're going to play Imperium the Contention. We have a three-player game set up with Unfiltered Gamer. We've got Grant and Michael here. Let's do it. Michael's playing the uh, the SEC, who are a technocracy from Mender Galaxy. Grant is a race of machines, the Mechan. And I am the Terran Alliance, lowly humans. And we're, we're going to begin with getting resources. We all get two our first turn. And then we're all going to draw a card. And I'm going to start with the Void Scepter. So I get to decide where to settle first. I'm going to settle here. And it is a wormhole. I'll settle over here. Oh, it's the abandoned station. I'm going to go right here next to my home world, which oh my is God. another wormhole <laughs> right next to yours. That's great. I'm sure that won't be a problem. No, not an issue at all. Okay, um, <clears throat> so now we play cards. We all put a card face down on the table, and when we all have something, we flip. If you don't want to play anything, you can play the bluff card, and resources carry over to next turn, so you can just save up if you don't want to play anything. Is there a cap on anything? There's no cap on hand size or how many resources you can have. We all flip. Bluff, bluff, and you're playing an alliance dropship. All right. Yep, I pay two. And that's all my resources, so I'm out of the face off. Okay, bluffs all around, so we go on to battle. We're not close enough to attack each other, so priority passes to you, and we begin again. Uh, we all get resources. So we get three now? Yeah, we all get three. Worlds you control, plus one, so it's three. And Grant have a total of five, and you've got a total of three. And we all draw. Hmm. Okay, so you get to do your thing first. I'll just settle over here. Oh, it's jungle world. Doesn't seem very good for my people. <laughs> and I've got an artifact world, which means that my tech costs one less to a minimum of one. Yeah, you're one of the best factions the to have. The current artifacts hide many secrets. They were far more advanced than we are now. Okay, so I'm going to move. I'm going to be super aggressive, see how that works out for me. No! I use the wormhole to jump here. And then I'm going to settle... Here. And this says I gain a resource immediately. What? And now we play cards. Now we can also only play our ships on locations like our home world or other locations that specifically state that we can play them. And right now it looks like that only our home worlds have that capability. Yeah, only our home worlds. Uh, I thought there's additional cards that you can find them. I know there's the capital, of course. Yeah, I, I can reveal this because it doesn't like reveal any of the board, but anything that says shipyard. So the, and there are other there. ones on here that are shipyards potentially, right? Yes. Yes, okay. And nothing available currently right now. Right. And there are some cards in your deck that will say shipyard on them. Okay, so we're all playing stuff. Total of five currency. Okay, and artifacts are my tech. And tech are basically what? Because they're not ships, right? Uh, tech will say, they'll be purple and say tech on them. Okay. Ah, all right. Flippity flip. Play a battle cruiser. Oh, that looks good. I play advanced AI. I draw an extra card every turn. Cost me five, though. Cost me three. And next face up round. And you are out, sir. There's my bluff card. Okay. I bluff. You play one of the best ships in the game. But mine costs more, so it must be better. <laughs> How many cards are in your hand, Grant? Six. Six. So that is currently a 6-6-2 six, six, ship. Oh, wow. So it's tech and defense equal to hand size? Yes. Okay. And that'll 
change as his hand size changes. Okay, and one last face up round. Bluffs all around. And we are on to attacking. attacking. So I attack the wormhole. It goes kaboom. So I lose my... Lose your token, you lose one favor, and I gain two. Now if I go to zero, what happens in this, in this mode? Nothing. Nothing, okay. Just that much harder for you to win. No, because it's a drop ship, you also settle it. Oh, that's true. Thank you for pointing that out. This has troops, and I actually don't want this because it's really hard to defend, but I now have a wormhole over here. Well, you taught him well. The student is now the master. Okay, so that's all the violence this turn. We go I have on. a battle cruiser, which says when enemy ships enter this sector, their movement ends. Yes. Now, if I walk into your sector, you can still move out of it then, correct? Yes. Okay. But it's only when you walk in. So if you want to get to here and I was here, and you went doot doot, you'd have to stop there. Yes. Okay. Locking a ship down is another ability called Tractor Beam, which this guy has. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Alright, next part. Yep, next turn. We all get resources. I only get three now. And you get five. Get five. And you get to draw an extra card. Draw Sounds cards. nice! <laughs> hmm. You move ships first, sir. Okay. What's your develop? Oh, do I move ships or do I develop first? You you move ships, then you develop. Okay. <sighs> Let me go with this one here. And part of my choices is one for favor. You do! Okay, I'm at three. Alright. I'm going to... give three resources. I'm going to be extra mean and see how that works out for me. Yep. And then I'm going to settle here. Okay. Yep. You're up. Grant's getting away with murder right now. He's the only one that's uh, not getting attacked yet. So, at the end of this movement, I can look at this. Yep, you get to see what that is. And you don't have to settle that one. You can sell something else if you don't like it. I'll settle it. Volcanic World. You can pay two to put an extractor on it, and its construction produces one at currency. What does that mean? Just plus one currency. If you spend two. Right now? Yes. yes. You can only do it right now. And what do we have a... Oh, yeah, we have an extractor token. Nice. There we go. All right. Cards? Flip. Okay. I play a missile cruiser. I have my home world. Cost five. And I can guess what you're doing. Yes. This is destroyed. Yes. Alright, next face up round. Okay. Uh, no battle this turn. And we're on to next turn. Now do I get- I can't do anything with this thing? Oh yeah. Yeah, now you're destroying it. That's right. And I lose one favor, and you gain two. And does this get flipped over, then? Yes, it is flipped over. And you can resettle it if you want to. Okay. okay. So is this start right now? Is when that, get, that happens? Yeah, you'll start getting more resources right now. I still get five. So I get six, right? That One, sounds two, right. One, two, three, four, and five, and six, yes. Four for your areas. One for your extractor, and then plus one. Okay, I'm going to move this ship 
Ooh, I'm scared of your battle cruiser. Oh, this is bad. I'm not handling Grant so that he doesn't mess up. I move there and I settle here. Okay. And Grant is up. No, you turn Grant. The Cloud World. Are you gonna move? I'm just going to point out that um, a lot of the strategy revolves around when someone uh, has the Void Scepter. I acted first, so if you were to do something like move here, it would be hard for me to react to it because I already moved my ships. Now your range of one gives you an addition, you can, instead of just attacking here, you can attack here? Yes, I can fire into here at your ship, so if I have some tricks I may be able to destroy your ship, but your ship would usually, in most circumstances, get a shot off at my world, at worst. Okay. I'm also going to point out, you could have taken the Imperial Capital this turn. You could have moved here and then settled it. No, that makes me an enemy. I'll just move here. And how many cards? What, what is that guy right there you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He's a seven, seven? Yep. Seven, seven, Jeez. two. Wait, are you staying here? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good move. <laughs> Hmm. One, two, three. I'm gonna go. What is backlash? It's when something's destroyed. I'll go here. Take a peek. Huh. Okay. And settle this. All right. Cool. Okay, so we all play cards. What's your maximum hand size? There is none. Oh my gosh. So he can get very big. He can. He's only drawing one card a turn now. He only gets smaller as he plays stuff. Okay, I'm gonna play this. Missile base? Transporters. It only cost me three. Now where can I attach my transporter tech? Uh, tech are played off the map, so you just put it somewhere close to you. All my ships get boarding. When they destroy a ship and yours survives, you can return the control ship to, to play. Yes. It's like troops, but you got to survive the battle, and it applies to ships. Okay, so next face-up round. Missile strike. I'm going to fire at this. For two? Yes. So that's one, two, three, oh, four, five, six, seven. Oh, he bluffed you into moving there. Well, I'm using a lot of resources here, but I currently have enough damage to destroy that. Okay. You do have seven cards in your hand, right? I have six. You have six. Okay. Um... Cool, so I everything fires here, and then you can fire at my ice world. Okay. So you'll lose control of this? Yes. I lose one favor, you gain two. And remind people how, how it works again? If you get ten favor? Yeah, ten at the end of the turn, then you win. And okay. he lost his big ship. Yes. It's in the lead with favor, though, and it is now next turn. One, two, three, yeah, this goes to you. Five. I get 
five. Oh, I'm breaking you down to size. I draw two. You move first. Let's draw one. Can these move? Stations can't move. And stations go where? Uh, any location you control. Every turn? Yes. There's a maximum number of them, though. Uh, it's two. You can't have more than two of them in play at a time. All right, so I'll move here. And... Cool. It's your go. Hmm. Oh, we draw cards and we get our resources, right? Yes. Draw one. Oh, you are boarding now. Yes. That's scary. Now, if I move this guy in here to fight, though, you can double, double attack me, right? So yeah. I wouldn't get boarding. Right. Only if I defeat it all by myself. Yes, you, you have to survive the battle. So you can build things on any colony you have? Stations can go on, on any colony. Draw a card and then discard one. Yeah. Um. Yes, that's right. And or otherwise, I lose a favor, right? Yes. I'm gonna get rid of. This one. Okay. So now I'm going to go here. Why do I feel like I'm walking into a trap? I'm walking into a trap. I know it. I know it. But the thing is, if you attack me, you're also walking into a trap. <laughs> it's just not the one you think it is. <laughs> right, you're not supposed to say things. Just let him do what he wants to do. You're welcome to go there. Okay, I go there, yeah. and I am going to settle here. All right, let's play cards. Let's see what you have, you rogue. <laughs> huh. If I did my normal first move, it would have been very interesting. I want to do it is the question. Alliance drop ship. How much currency do you have left? I have three left. Grant? I have eight. <laughs> I'll put an automated factory here. Okay, you can do that, right? Yes. How do I do it? Just put this here? Yeah, you just drop it on. Ooh, that's a lot of eggs in that basket. Okay, we go again. What are you keep looking at me for? Because I know you got tricks. 
Okay. Engine bug. Where's that going? So this is just, uh, it just attaches to a thing? Yeah, so then it can't move. I don't like that thing. Okay, that's staying there. Hmm. Okay, face off is over. Battle, I'm going to fire. You keep hitting me, he's gonna start. I mean, he's already building up, just letting you know. I know. Um,. All I've got is one ship. All the ship can do now is sit here and fire at you. Yep. <laughs> I hit this. I gain two favor. Okay, and next turn. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oops. I'm just going to point out, if you were to take control of this with, with boarding or something, this goes away. Because it's technically destroyed, removing this, then you gain control of it. Gotcha. Oh no, I didn't think about that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. One of these babies? No. Oh no no, 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 we get to move and stuff. Yeah, um, okay. yeah, you move first. Alright, what do you got? You got one, two... Did you really plan that? You planned to lock my ship down so he could take it. I'll just eh, put this actually. Draw bodies again. Draw a card. Let's go ahead and get rid of. Okay, um, I'm going to go, why, if I keep on attacking you, it's, <laughs> he's just going to win, but you're so close, it's just so tempting. Well, you could come at me, but I've probably planned for that. Yeah, I know going... Now you're sitting on a pile of resources, and going after you is going to be hard. <sighs> yeah, I'm going there, and I'm going to... No, I'm going to go... I'm going to go here. And I'm going to settle... I'm actually going to go here and settle here. Okay. So I'm all in over here. Yeah. Okay. You're up. That's it. Oh, I already moved and stuff. So oh, wait, I settle, right? It's move and settle? Yeah, you move, then you settle. Oh, you didn't... Uh, I, did, I did my turn. I was starting first. Okay. Now, there's other actions you can do during this, right? What? Which ones are they? Instead of settling, there's something else you can there's, do. Usually. There's certain ones on the actual cards themselves that will say something, um, in which you can use those instead. Oh, develop, like develop actions. Yeah, your home worlds all have a develop ability. That's okay. unique to your faction. Okay. Okay, let's play cards. Yeah. 
You're really avoiding the capital. Oh god. Okay. What was that? <laughs> That's the most powerful card in the game. The gate to sec prime, it pops out 8-8 eight, eight dreadnoughts. And uh, they're all going to have boarding, because he has transporters in play. <clears throat> Alright. Next face-up round. But I can only get a maximum of two dreadnoughts. Yes, you can have more than two. Where does that go on? Catch it to a new ship and it can't just move again. Put that, put that right there. The heavy oh, battle. God. <laughs> okay. He's just gonna <laughs> chill there for a bit, huh? Well, my home world's safe, I guess. Huh. That's one way of looking at it. Unless you have an enemy dreadnought walk over there. <laughs> Alright, next face off. Production matrix. Jeez, he's getting a lot of money. Promo. Okay. Wow. Okay. Um, battle. You're destroying this? Yes. All right, you gain two favor, I lose one. Again. Why did you? Yeah, you're gonna lose one, and I'm picking which one to destroy. I'll destroy this one. Oh, you can then settle it again. I keep doing either one of these. Oh, this this says once per player per game. Oh, it does. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll hit that one. Okay, I gain two. And I have four. And anyone else got another target? That's everything. Okay, um, next turn. And he gets dread on. Six, seven, one, two, three, four. Draw two. I move first. What do you have? You have a six five here, a one one, a two two, and then the three threes. Yeah. This game is about to go horribly for me. Um, I'm just gonna do something crazy and see what happens. Yeah, so I have two ships that's going to be capital, and I'm going to take it. And I'm sure this will go just great. It'll go great. <laughs> All right. And in the beginning of your... So how does this one work? So, so now, uh, now it's going to be at beginning of turn, I will gain two favor. Okay. That's right. You're up. No, if I have units here and he moves, does he stop here or can he move through here and attack you? Uh, you can move, if I move past someone's oh. units. Okay, so if I move here, he can move here and attack you? That's correct. Okay. Abilities like intercept and tractor beam stop ships from moving through their space. Makes sense.
So I can also move like this. Yep. Yes. And then settle this. Settle this one. Okay, so he loses a favor. You. I am at three. <laughs> okay. You're up. Hmm. Move your armada. I'm like running out of things to do here. You move first. Yeah. Settle this, I suppose. Once again, the wormhole. Okay. Let's play cards. Hmm. Eight. 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 Eight, eight. Okay, hmm. I play Admiral Raquel Reinek, and I'll put her on this thing that can't go anywhere. All my ships get plus one, plus one while she's in play. Yep. You pay for She costs three. Okay. <clears throat> oh, no cards. That means bluff, right? Yeah. Tactical advantage. I give this plus two, plus two. So it is currently a six, six. Yep. Resources, no problem. <laughs> what else can I do? Yep. Do I have to go again? Um. Sure. Okay. <laughs> How many cards are in your hand? Six. Six. Okay. Uh, battle time. So um, you go first, right? Yeah. Oh. I attack the dreadnought for. Yeah, for eight. And okay. um, what else can I do? Now, do I respond with my Dreadnought or no? Yes, you're firing back at the same time. Can so, I also fire with this one if I wanted to? Oh, yeah, that can fire. I can choose what I want to fire at, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, so this. Oh, so this can be involved in combat even though it's not there because it has the range? Yes. yes. I'm and... not going to be doing that, though. Hold on a second. Oh, yeah, you, you can use the boarding ability at range now. Yeah. So you can take the ship. I'm not going to be taking this one, though. I'm gonna, we're both going to die. Okay. <laughs> All right, so... Um, so the Dreadnought goes, and so does yours? Yes. Else, along with your three cards, or two cards you played on it? Yes. It's a great trade. Four for nothing. Yeah. Uh, bad card advantage for me. All right, so it's just this one, right? Yeah. So you get that. I lose one, you gain two. And He's you gain control now. of it. Now what happens when I don't have enough of these to place? If at end of turn you control, uh, you've placed all of them, you win. Okay, but so, it looks so like nothing happens, or what? Uh, your troops ability can't trigger, so it's destroyed. Okay, so I get two. Yes. Did you play seven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. yep. At, the end of his, at the end of this round, if he has all of them still there, he wins, right? Yes, that's correct. Where's my dudes? Your dudes, I uh, don't know what happened to them. Where'd they go? You discard them. Are they here? Oh yeah, this this, <laughs> this is them. Nope, that's my hand. This is them. Okay. Okay. And over here, you're destroying my bomber, and it's now your bomber. I like free bombers. 
And I also have to... In order for him not to win, I have to actually attack one of his faces. Yes. All right. Let's go ahead and make this go away. It's gone. There you go. You lose one. I gain two. Uh, yeah, I, I gain two. He loses one. That's correct. You're lucky I'm nice. Yeah. <laughs> After all the nastiness you've done to me. I know, I've been hard. I was actually going to poke one of your guys down and just take him. Yeah. Um, that would make sense. Okay, it is now next turn. And you have priority. You have another Dreadnought. And you get a Destroyer over there. Destroyer. From your Everforge. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. I gain six. I gain two favor because I control the capital. Mm -hmm. And I five. Draw two cards. You move first. Hmm. And he gets this back, basically, right? If if he wants it. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Why well, would he take that one too? If he wanted to. That's true. Yeah, with troops, it uh, gives him options. Okay. I'm not going for the capital, huh? Interesting. Okay. You can move your little destroyer, dude, too. Uh, plain defensive. And we got these guys too. No. Whose station is this? That's mine. How come you don't have a thing on here? Oh, it's oh. underneath it. Okay. Now, if I'm attacking this location here, do you get the plus three added to it? Um, you have to fire at the station first. Yes. And then you can go. Yeah, and it's one attack, one target. So you would need, like, both of them over here or something like that. I see. Hmm. We could attack him. I mean, I'm attacking his, his uh, destroyer over there. Move those two over there. Okay. I am going to go here and here. And I'm going to Settle here. Okay. Let's play cards. Oh, um, yes. I... Oh god. <clears throat> no reason to bluff at this point. <laughs> Big things are coming. 
I played Black Op to destroy the Heavy Destroyer. Yep. That costs three. That has a lot of money. How many cards do you have in hand? Two. Did not see that coming. Uh, okay. Turns pass. Oh, attacking. I'm going to attack both of these. Oh, he doesn't Grant go first for attacking, since he's got the first play marker? Yes, yeah, so you can choose targets first. So, I'll have this one. Yes, it's destroyed. I lose one favor. You gain two. I'm going to have this one, but this one's not strong enough anymore. Right. So, right. And you can choose targets. And backlash is equi equates to what exactly? When it's destroyed. So if you destroy this, um, because you have the transporters, you would gain control of it. But because it was destroyed, he would get a destroyer here. Okay. All right. So I'm going to use my heavy carrier range two to pop that one. It has popped. It is now your ship, and he gets a destroyer here. Do I actually get to use this if I want? Uh, no, because damage is simultaneous. There's no way you okay. could gain control of this and fire at it. All right, then these guys are going to take on this. Yeah, that looks destroyed. So he loses one by gain two? Yes. Uh, the Dreadnought's going to pop... The destroyer, because I can't hit this, right? Because it's being defended. Yes. That's now your destroyer. And I think that's it. Okay. I'm going to destroy both of these, and I'll use two favor. I gain four, and I immediately gain control of this. I'm at eight. And he's lost two more? Okay. All right. Okay, so next turn. This passes to me. I need another Dreadnought. Oh, God. Two, four, six, and seven. This board is insanely tense right now. I gain two favor, I am at ten. And I have a feeling I will not have ten favor at the end of this turn. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? Maybe it'll all work out. Alright, so I'm up now, right? Yeah, you're up. Mm-hmm. He's cute. He's a little dude. Yeah, he is a cute dude. He has no reason not to go there. <laughs> My singularity generator is pretty happy where he's at, too. I'm just going to point out your homeworld ability lets that, in essence, move three if you wanted to. This guy here? Yeah, or any ship you want can move one more. Plus one, right? Yeah. Uh... You're at ten right now? And you got that wormhole too. Yeah, I can just go one, two. It, it costs zero movement to go from here to oh, here. Oh, okay, so one. Yes. And he can't move, right? He cannot move. Okay, that's all my movement and stuff. I okay. Think. Oh. I guess I have no reason to just scare the heck out of you guys. 
Now, if I destroy this, do I gain control of it? Uh, no, that's that's troops. That's what troops does. You would just destroy it, and you'd have to settle it. So I have to wait till after you guys take two more turns before I can even get my hands on it again? Yes. But you will gain four favor for destroying it. Hmm. I'll just put him over there, then. Okay, and what's your bomber doing? Just going to stay there? Hmm. Yeah, he'll just stay there. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Um. Please work. <clears throat> Wait. There's no way I can defend everything. Um. <laughs> Is there? Oh shit. Okay. This goes here. This goes. Here. So no. Uh, that's crazy. It goes here. Okay. And I'm going to. I'm going to give this ship plus one, plus one. It's not going to save you. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Move here. I know you've got to play, so I'm just going to bluff until I decide I need to deal with you. Terran Alliance flagship. Six, seven. So I can still... Okay. We'll just play this 25-25. What is he? 25-25. Okay, next face-off round. <sighs> Separus missile. I deal three damage to up to three target ships or stations in this sector. You choose your target first, technically. So I'm going to do two damage to a ship and move it three sectors? Yes. This is your one. This is yours, right? Yes. One, two, three. Interesting. You can fight that thing. <laughs> okay, so my target for this is going to be. Let's see, one, two, three, four. And that's going to cost me two. Okay, so I'm dealing two damage to these three ships here, and that immediately destroys this yep. destroyer. I'm just going to leave that here to remind us that, about that damage. And uh, next face off. Did you spend, did you pay for that? Uh, nope. All right. Okay, I missile strike a dreadnought. So one of the dreadnoughts has four damage on it. Yep. Did you pay for it? One? Yes. Okay. Okay, short range destroyer. Uh, yeah, that's just sitting there. And I'm out.
storm. Okay. I choose a two by two area and destroy all two twos. Or just do two damage to everything. I'll choose these three areas here. Okay, because of Raquel Vrynek. Oh, you have a plus one plus one on them all, don't you? Yes. Oh, I didn't think about that. Well, let me decide where I want to place it then, because that matters now. What do you have here? Um, this is a 4-4. Four, four. So you have a 4-4 four, four here. And, and a 3-3. Three, three. Three, three. And you've got 4 damage on this guy here? Yes, and 2 on this one. four areas then. Okay. This destroyer is gone. And what's over here? Oh. Okay. Hmm. All right. Next face up round. Okay. You choose targets first, sir. All right, let's go ahead and deal with this first, then. This is my weaker one, so I'll 4-4, four, four, so I hit that one. Mm-hmm. And this one attacks this one? Yes. Okay, those ships will definitely be destroyed, but they will be able to um, destroy both dreadnoughts. Imperial Capital has two attack. These two can take out the weaker one, and... You can do eight damage to him? Wait, he has two damage assigned to him? Three. He has none, right? And he has four. Well, we have um, this, which dealt two damage. To up to three. three. Oh, okay. So, okay, so he has two damage on him. This can deal, uh, this deals one damage to each of them because of Rampage. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that takes care of the stronger one. Mm -hmm. And the one that I played Missile Strike on has... It looks like it survives by one. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Don't all your ships get plus one, plus one? Yeah. Yeah, he added that. This is five damage, right? That one already. Is, yeah, that one already. Four fired. damage. Yeah. Or this is three. Uh, this is three. So, and this is... so this is dealing three to this one, which already has two damage on it. That's four five. And then it was missile struck. That's six seven. I'm one damage short of killing it. Is there damage anywhere else? Nope. So one of the dreadnoughts lives. And I, do I choose which one of these I want to? No, you chose targets first, so I could destroy okay. the one that's so taken. This is mine then. Yeah, I basically choose which one you want, and it's that one. All right, so this stays here. You still got your capital though. Yeah. For another turn. For another turn. Unfortunately, I'm about to lose one favor. Okay, and this is whose destroyer? It's mine. Right. So I can, can I hit yours, or do I have to attack Grant's destroyer first? Actually, this is dead, isn't it? Because. Yes, that's that's gone. Oh, it is. Oh yeah. That's right. Well, that's why. I, okay, I, I would. All right. Well, that got messed up a little. That's my fault. And this is mine then. That's now no, yours. It's, no, it's mine. Well, well, I, you're, I, you, I you would have attacked it. Well, yeah. interesting. I can't stop him from getting victory points. I was gonna hit, stop him here. But I'm going to lose one favor before the turn's over, which puts me at nine at the end of the turn. And I've got a range of two here. There's nothing I can hit now. I think that's all my targets then. Yeah. Well, you can hit this. Oh wait, I have I have this guy here. Yeah. Oh, but it, it attacked this. So this is mine. Became yours. Yeah. But that could fire here, gaining you two favor. Oh, that's true. And then we have. I'm assuming you destroy my flagship over here. Someone does. 
That's not me. It's I'm doing my targets first, right? Yeah. Um, so that gets removed. I, I gain two. You gain two. And now I'm done with all my attacks. Now it's Grant. Well, don't you have this, right? Do I have a guy here? Yeah, yeah. you have the battle cruiser. Oh, okay. It doesn't have much it can do though. Everything's too strong there. Uh. Can I choose this is not too. Oh wait, you ion stormed over there, so you can take out my flagship. One, two, yeah, you but force mine, jumped it. But mine wouldn't survive, would it? No, uh, but I didn't choose a target yet, so we'll see what I do. But yeah, I'll probably take it out. But you can I'm, definitely. Well, he chooses the target first, yeah, and you then choose you the choose and I choose, right? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Um, you can take out my flagship. I mean, it doesn't matter. They're both gonna go. I pass. It doesn't matter. You'll you'll you can take mine. If you and then Grant will take you. He's gonna, Grant's gonna take whoever's yeah, left. Yeah. So it, it makes no difference. Right, you, you fire at my ship. You, you fire at whoever's gone. ship's left over, so Grant's yeah. gonna survive there. That is true. Okay, I believe that's all the battles. This. You destroy it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Drop in you down one. I lose nine. You gain two. You lose nine. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm down to nine. Okay. Okay, that's everything. Here you go. Thanks for being first. You'll enjoy it. Yeah. Okay, everyone gets resources. One, two, three, four. Oh, beginning of my turn. I get my dreadnought back. That's nice. It's a great card you added. I like that gate to Sec Prime. Yeah, I love it too. Okay, um, gee, uh, wow, um, so my fleet is now your fleet, um, <clears throat> hmm, where do all my ships go? To that side of the board? Yeah, um, well that makes my turn easier, um, your turn. <laughs> I, by the way, I gained two favors, so I'm at 11 right now. It only moves one. It moves two. Oh, nice. Where'd you move it to? Because it moves, all my ships move plus one. Oh, you moved it to here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh. I can't kill it. It. Well, now, what if you have nothing left? No ships? Well, you have nothing. You have no home world either. Can you not lose your home world then? You can. And you can resettle it. But you're, you're going to lose four favor when you lose it. I see. And someone else could settle it, which locks you out of having one until the game's over. Unless you destroy it. So basically, everything on the board is mine except for Grant's one ship... Is this all yours here, Grant, on this dude? Oh, uh, well, it's all on the planet. Oh. Oh, you get a destroyer token. If someone else settles your home world, it's a ravaged world. Oh, okay. So it's. They don't get your home world. Shwink. But you can resettle it, basically, then. How'd you get another destroyer? Oh, the destroyer return. It's a small version of that. And is, is that attached to your ship there? No, it's on the planet. Oh, okay. Okay, what are you doing, Grant? You're done. That's it. Yeah. Uh, and then settle, right? Yep. Well, actually, if it's settled, I'm just going to leave this here. <clears throat> hmm. You're at 11 now? So yeah. you can go up higher then. Yes, if I'm at 10 or higher at the end of the turn, I win. Uh, 
another wormhole. We're really going for the home world. He can. He, he has bombard. I know, but this does actually one damage to him, which will defeat him. That's true. You'll get the favor, though. These two are mine, this is yours, right? Yeah. All attached, basically? Yeah. Does it give him any bonuses? No. No. Okay. <clears throat> well, he has seven. He's a 7-6 a because of the Admiral. I was trying to calculate which ones are mine. The next version, the next prototype I have that I'm working on, every faction will have all their cards of one color. So all your stuff would be green, all my stuff is blue, all your stuff is yellow. It'll make sorting much easier. Okay. All right. Let's play cards. You're, you're, you're done, right? Yes. Okay. You know when things don't go well for the humans, they just hurl insults. Singularity generator. You lose two favor. That's okay. <laughs> okay. Um. dislocation. <laughs> okay. So now I can choose any two locations to switch as long as they're two away from each other, correct? Yes. So if I wanted to, I could take this, right, and switch it with this. Correct? Yes. Why would you want to? I'm trying to think of what other... Because like you're in a position... You're in a position to destroy the capital right I now. I know. My only problem is he's coming for it. What other could I? What else could but I? But you do? could win this turn. Yeah. You could end the turn with more than ten. If you destroy this, you gain four. Ah, I have a better idea. I will switch. Oh well, it's just the location though, isn't it? Just it's the... not the characters on it either. Right. Anything that's attached to the location moves with it, but everything else stays where it is. Hmm. So, like, if you move to your homeworld, the gate to Sec Prime stays on it. You could probably win with that card right now. If you switch to right ones. Because if this gives you four, and this gives you two... If you hit one more, you can end the turn with more than 10 favors. Now, does this go with it, too, then? Yeah, the token would go with it. Whoever controls it doesn't change. By the way, who controls this? Oh. Hmm. I think 
think there's a way for you to win here. If you switch these two, then your Singularity Generator is now attacking a jungle world. So that's mine, though. Oh, that's your jungle world. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. If, if I could pull one of yours... I've got this area already. Lock that one down. That one's already being dealt with. You could switch your home world. Yeah, because then maybe you can take out the forest world or something else. I'm going to actually switch this one here with this one. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Cool. Okay. All right, next face off. Black Op, I destroy my own Alliance dropship. <laughs> and I'm out of resources. Okay. I don't know what to play it on, though. What does it do? Uh, target thing loses all abilities and can't attack this turn. You don't want to target this. You, we need to drop him low, below 11. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know what your choices are. Which are mean to him. <laughs> this, I think. Okay. So he can't attack this turn. That's correct. <sighs> Alright. Next face up round. I am out, so it's just you guys. Okay, battle. Uh, you start. Uh, my home world fires at... Oh, and, and this fire at the Dreadnought. So the Dreadnought will be destroyed. And the Dreadnought's gonna poke this guy. Imperial Capital will fire and, at... And the Destroyer will poke this. Well, let's do this first, right? Yeah, okay, let's do this first. So the Dreadnought will be destroyed, and this will be destroyed. Now, he survives, so does that mean he actually gets to take control of it with transporters? Um, that... When this destroys a ship. Yes, that is what that means. It is now your <laughs> battle cruiser. Do I get Admiral too? No. Why not? Because when it's destroyed, it clears everything attached. I to lose it. my Dreadnought though, right? Yes. Good. I need, I, need, I need a new one for next round. So. <laughs> All right, and I can't hit your home world because I need seven. Yes. Okay. I destroy this ship, and then you're gonna hit. My well, capital. Well, it'll be, it'll be Grant will be doing his stuff. You destroyed this with what? The capital. Fires uh, for oh, two. Oh, okay. So then I would actually hit that one, yeah. Yes. So I go up to I go up four. You go up four. I go down four. Capital is destroyed. And that's seven. Okay. I don't think I have any attacks. You got this also. I know. I'm a, so now it's Grant, right? For his prior for his. So you have no attacks, Grant. Okay, so now oh, it's mine. Uh, Grant has this one. That's mine. Oh, okay. So I'm up next now, right? Yes. So I'm going to bombard this. Yes. I lose one, you gain two. And then I'm going to hit this one too. Yep. I'm at five. This gets overkill, right? That gets right? destroyed. Yeah. And I can't fire with this. Nope, but it looks like the sec have won it. That's it? And then that's the end of the game, end of the turn? Uh, yeah, there's nothing else that can happen, so, so it's a sec one. two, four, five, six, seven. I won with this one. You won with condition. both conditions. And I won with this one here. Oh, well. nice. Well played, sir. Well done! A good game indeed, gentlemen. So that is the Imperium, the contention with, is it some new rules? Is it a variant? So we're, we're testing the, um, 
be the winning by victory points instead of by player elimination, which was the original way to do it. Yep. Um, now that the game is going all the way up to six player, we don't want anyone to be sitting around for 45 minutes while they wait for everyone else to finish. So I feel like this will account for any player count better. You guys have some fun? Enjoy yeah. it? Is it working well for you? I really liked the progression of that game, how you were down and how and how you were like strong and then Yeah. I sat there on back. purpose just saving the currency, placing the big things down and waiting and letting you guys do the things. The only thing is you were hitting me a lot, so I was like, Well, if I just back off and let Grant start building I also had a car to deal with this. I was just waiting. Shuffle a ship into a friendly player's library if they're on the location. Did I control? Yeah. But you never walked. I was like, he's going to walk here. And I like, try and control my things. And I'm just going to be like, put it back in your deck, please. But that, that never happened. But yeah, thanks for coming over and playing with us. Yeah, thanks for having me. Of course.